teamed up with Harkila, specialists in outdoor wear for shooting, hunting and hiking. I've been invited to head office to see why their clothes are renowned worldwide for quality and performance. In this playlist we're going beneath the fabric, you'll see some of the best and newest pieces that are available and soon to come. The last one in this series I want to show you in Mountain Hunter. This is Mountain Hunter Hybrid. So this is designed in a very similar way to the first jacket I showed you in the Mountain Hunter series. Um, but this is a warm weather version. So the weather we've had earlier on this year that was warm but wet. So you've got a mixture, it was a lovely day, the sun was out, then it rained, then you had a shower, then it dried up, and then it did absolutely everything, and then it was windy. So this is designed to cope with those conditions and be the best of all worlds. The body in this lighter, slightly lighter green material is actually a soft shell fabric, uh, and this is very breathable. So it's not actually completely waterproof, um, I know it sounds a surprise, but it's not completely waterproof because we believe it doesn't actually need to be to, you know, keep you dry enough to actually function as a, as a stalker. This dark green fabric and this reinforced fabric, these are waterproof. So you've got waterproof shoulders, waterproof top of the hood, down the arms, all the way down the arms. So this piece is waterproof, but the body being a soft shell is very breathable. So if you're working hard, you need the best of both worlds because you don't want to be creating a lot of heat inside your jacket for it to go nowhere and it'll just condense inside the jacket and you'll start to feel wet. So if you're working hard, you're walking up hills, moving fast or moving around carrying a lot of stuff, this is great because it lets you breathe very much more easily. In fact, it's the breathability that is absolutely the key and why Gore-Tex products work very well is because they are more breathable than they are waterproof and so you tend to stay drier longer. In a cheaper um, jacket you'll find that it's got a waterproof membrane but it's not a very breathable membrane so you create as much heat and as much sweat basically condensing inside the jacket than comes through the outside from the rain. So. Breathability is absolutely the key to staying comfortable and relatively dry in those sort of conditions. This has got the big tough YKK zip. There's no lining as such in this because this is a lightweight summer piece. So this would be designed as something like a Roebuck stalking. Something that's going to happen in um, April, in April, May, when the buck season comes on. Roebuck stalking is the, the Danish passion, whereas ours is probably pheasant shooting and partridge shooting, roebuck shooting is what the Danes live for in terms of shooting. And this is their, for them really, is their version of it. It also works extremely well in the UK. As you've seen on some of the other things we've done, you've got a removable hood that unzips across here. The hood is waterproof at the top, but breathable at the sides. This is a really, really great piece. And because it's not waterproof throughout, um, is actually pretty good value. We don't often talk about good value with Haki Libisis because we don't aim to give a very good value product. We want to make a very good product that works very well. And sadly, sometimes those things are quite expensive. But um, to get something that's gonna do a good job, you need to pay a reasonable price. This, because of what it is, um, is actually much more reasonable and it works really well, surprisingly well. It has trousers that go with it and the trousers have got a waterproof bum and waterproof up to the knee and that will keep you really, really warm and dry because you're not going to get wet. Um, the top of the trouser is highly breathable because that's where you create the heat. So actually it's a great compromise between waterproof and breathable. Thanks again to Simon for giving us these demonstrations. The next video is going to be all about the Heat Series jacket and I can't wait to show you. If you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button and I will see you soon.